I'm Eddie Freinich. I'm broker owner, Golden Gate Real Estate Management. We're a full service property management company right here in Contra Costa County. And our topic of discussion today is, should I increase my rent? Great question, common question, and it's an ongoing question for investors. Well, the answer is maybe yes, maybe no. First, what you need to do is determine, will the market warrant an increase in rent? So you do a rental market analysis, compare your property to other rental properties, see what it says. If it shows the market will bear an increase in rent, go ahead and increase your rent. However, there's a little bit more to it and other factors that you probably want to take into consideration rather than just what the market is saying. Uh, for example, if it's summertime and maybe it's a, a firm, strong market and you can get a tenant in only 15 days, short vacancy, well, well that's, that's going to help your cause. However, if it's a soft market, maybe during that, the holiday season, maybe not so good. It might take 45 days or, to get your property rented out, so your risk versus gain might not look too good. Now, before you tell your tenant that you are increasing uh, the rent, you need to make sure you understand the upside and the downside. So the upside is if you increase it $50 at $600 a year, $200 uh, for, excuse me, $1,200 for two years. Now, once they cast out of the bag and you let your tenant know that you're increasing the rent, if they tell you that, you know what, we really don't want the increase in rent, and as soon as you told us this, we were looking for another property, and, and here's our 30-day notice, okay? So now you can have a, a vacancy. And when you have this vacancy, of course, it's going to cost you some money. And then you're going to have a, a, a turnover as far as you need a rekey. You might have some paint or carpeting or releasing fee. So a turnover is expensive. So again, include a lot of, um, a lot of different information to base your decision whether you're going to give that tenant a 30-day notice or not. You may want to include your decision based on the quality of your current tenant. If you got a great tenant, you really want to jeopardize increasing the rent and again, getting that 30-day notice. Now, if you have a poor tenant, you know, that may work for you a little bit better. If you have a tenant that's uh, late on their rent every month, they're not taking care of the property, they're hard on the property, uh, the paint is, is not looking too good, they're not taking care of the landscaping, so that might be a good time for you to go ahead and increase the rent. Not a lot to lose if the tenant gives you a 30-day notice. Now also, a good time to increase your rent is when your current tenant issues a 30-day notice, okay? They're leaving for sure, okay? So you can put that property back on the market immediately once they give you the 30-day notice and increase the rent. Test the water, so to speak. And after a couple weeks, you'll know how many inquiries you have, have had, how many uh, showings and applications and so forth. And if you're getting a lot of activity, well then maybe you're going to be fine with that increase uh, in rent. However, if you've only got a couple showings after two weeks, you may decide that, you know, I tested the waters, didn't quite work out as I had planned, but I'm not going to lose them a lot because I still have that tenant in there because they gave me a 30-day notice. I'll reduce the rent back down uh, and find me a good quality long-term tenant. So now, of course, the goal is to increase your rent on a slow, regular uh, basis. And you want to make sure that you keep that quality tenant in there uh, if you can. So you want to make sure that you have an informed decision whenever you raise the rent. Hopefully that information is helpful for you. If you have any questions or concerns about this topic or need any information about another management topic, again, I'm Eddie Franich with Golden Gate Real Estate Management. Thanks for watching.